Hey, hope you're well everyone. This is Aria with another weekly fighting game news update. First of all, the next game in a 3D Dragon Ball Z arena fighter franchise, Budokai Tenkaichi 4, was announced during the DBFC World Tour 2022-2023 Finals. The short teaser featuring Goku transforming into Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan didn't reveal much else such as release date or platforms, so stay tuned for more news. Arslan Sadiq, better known as Arslan Ash, has announced his new team. The Pakistani player, who rose to prominence in 2018, left his former team, Fate Esports, in January, and has been without an official team sponsor since then. In an announcement on his Twitter page, Arslan said that he'd be joining Twisted Minds, a team formed in 2021 from Saudi Arabia, and he'll be one of their fighting game representatives. Twisted Minds is another indication of the huge push from Saudi Arabia into the esports sphere, and they already have teams in games like Rainbow Six, PUBG, Valorant, and Rocket League. Street Fighter VI has announced its latest real-time commentator with Japanese actress Hikaru Takahashi. She joins a rather diverse cast of commentators that have so far featured some of the biggest names in fighting game casting, along with other surprising individuals like Zelina Vega and Demon Kaka. While this in itself was a great announcement, what really caught people's eyes was the gameplay footage which featured two fights, one between Kami and Lily, and the other between Zangief and Marissa. Bandai Namco has released a two-minute Tekken 8 gameplay trailer that focuses entirely on the redesigned Paul Phoenix. Mr. Toughest in the Universe has changed his outfit and mastered new techniques, including a guard break after a heat engager. Also, gotta love that smile. At the conclusion of the Arc World Tour 2022 Finals, the Guilty Gear Strive development team took to the stage to announce and show some upcoming content, including the new character Bedman and their accompanying stage, which will be available on April 6th. This was along with a tease for a new Daredevil in May, and perhaps confirmation that the development team is working on Season 3. Speaking of which, the Arc World Tour 2022 ended in a wonderfully electric final, which included a number of upsets and well-deserved wins. Goichi and Mochi took home an overall $100,000 prize pool, winning DNF Duel and Guilty Gear Strive, respectively. And finally, Collision 2023 took place over the weekend, with Riddles winning the Ultimate Singles Tournament with Kazuya Mishima, and also qualifying for Ultimate Summit 6, while JMook secured the gold in Melee. And that's that for this week's fighting game news. Please subscribe for more weekly updates. This has been Arya from That Blasted Salami, wishing you an excellent day.